Halo 5 Informer here today. Now, um, we are going to talk about something that's been talked about by a lot of people, actually, but it still does not hurt to talk about this topic. It is an important topic. And what that is, is, um, why is Chief wearing that cloak in the Halo on Xbox One trailer? What could it possibly mean? So, let's get started with this. So, basically, he could be going rogue. This is the biggest thing going out around there, um, what everybody's thinking. And it makes sense in a lot of ways to think that. So, basically, if you do notice, his visor is cracked. Now, this is actually one of the key pictures to look at. Because, um, you know, if he was going rogue, it would explain why he couldn't get that repaired. Um, it's one of the bigger things to look at. It does make sense in that formation. Um, it's probably one of the biggest uh, reasons out there and why people are thinking this. But at the same time, um, he could be wearing that cloak to hide. He could be hiding from enemies, the Prometheans, maybe even the UNSC. He did get in some trouble with some um, hierarchies in Halo 4, as we do know. And we do know that the Halo um, UNSC Council are not the most friendly people from Spartan Ops. Um, and, you know, he got in, like, he got in a lot of trouble with a higher, higher, um, leader, I would say. And, you know, it could cause some problems. Maybe Captain Lasky or someone from the UNSC helped sneak him out, possibly. Now, these are just, uh, theories on that. But it, it is, uh, pretty much showing him hiding himself. So that's, like, an, that's another huge one. And at the same time, this does, uh, fit in with the rogue idea. And then what we also have to talk about is um how does his armor react due to um him not having Cortana with him anymore? Now, um due to him not having an AI, his armor, his shields, everything that has to do with that probably does not run at the same capacity. His shields could be like flipping off for all we know. Um, you know, they might not even be as powerful. He doesn't have like an AI to ru help run all of that equipment. And it's really going to affect how he is in the next Halo. Because if you think about it, without um, Cortana, she helped him a lot. Without that, he's going to have to like be more cautious of what he does and what he thinks about doing. So, you know, without Cortana, this also explains why he could be wearing that, um, that cloak. Now, with that cloak um, being said, like being worn on him, yeah... With that cloak being worn on him, it can tell us two things. First, it can tell us that, you know, um, since he has that cracked visor, he could be hiding um, his face from, you know, sand. So sand doesn't get in, or sand doesn't get in his armor, because I do believe he's not wearing his exosuit, um, or his exoskeleton. So that could explain that. Or, um, you know, radiation or heat damage, you know, any of that could be affecting his armor since he does not have Cortana to help protect him from that. That could be doing an effect on him too. These are two very good, valuable reasons. And, you know, this is all the stuff that uh, pretty much fits in with the idea of that cloak being worn. Um, with him going rogue, he could be hiding or he could just be, um, you know, malfunctioning. Now, I am going more on the side with the rogue in hiding because that makes a lot of sense in different ways. Maybe he wants to keep the UNSC out. Maybe he just wants to make new allies. He doesn't want the UNSC to know because what he's about to do, it doesn't make sense to them. So these are like all the different things we can look at, what we can think about. Um, I do want to thank you guys so much for tuning in today on Halo 5 Informer. I really enjoy your guys' feedback, everything you guys have to say. Um, my subscribers have been going up a lot lately. I want to thank you guys so much for that. Please keep up the awesomeness because I am going to keep putting tons of Halo content on here. I'm sorry that I haven't been posting um, lately. I've been having some problems with my Elgato. I will work on that and try to fix that. So I want to thank you guys again for watching. Um... I will see you guys next time on Halo 5 Informer. Peace. All that's left is a window to my soul. Come and get it.